Hi everyone, I'm Naman Gupta and welcome to the new episode of Developer Spotlight where we interview our developers from our Zbyte community who are building some really cool uh, decentralized applications on our platform. So today we have Man Pathak with us. Man, a very warm welcome to a new episode of Developer Spotlight. Hello sir, how are you sir? I'm good, very well. Thank you so much. Thanks for asking. How are you? How are you feeling? You have built some really cool tab that I've just seen, and I'm really excited. Uh, you know, for all the viewers who are watching us, they should also experience and see what was your tab process. So I'm quite excited to speak to you. Yes, sir. Same. Yes, Perfect. Sir. So tell me about. You can share your screen and you can show us your tab, and then take us through your tab process. What was your idea, and how did you go about it? How easy or difficult it was? and uh, 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 what is the core crux of your tab? So yeah. Yes, sir. Is it visible? Yes, it's visible. Yeah. So I'll just preview it so that we can have a nice glance at it. So yeah. Uh, yes, sir. So this is our tab, sir. Uh, and uh, we were instructed to uh, like uh, make a tab which is uh, which captures the picture and mints it on uh, the uh, other uh, side. So what we we took it a step step further and we thought of uh, uh, two options. For example, whenever we uh, upload any uh, display picture of ours on any social media app, then it uh, asks for two options. One, uh, whether take a picture right now or uh, you already have a picture and you have to just uh, put it on the DP and uh, mostly people prefer the second option. So we thought why not uh, to take this thing into uh, the DAP thing also. So this is our first form and yeah, yeah, you can see this great amazing UI of outer photo with you, which you already, which you want to mint, then you can directly select on select image or if you want to take a snap, then it goes to the snap. So if I click on select image, then I'll be taken to this image page where uh, you know you you can have the file selected. And here Got I it. have a picker like a file picker which was provided by Zbyte and it's uh, uh, you can say in its package. And here if I click on the select, so there's a window and I can browse my files out here. And for example, if I show you uh, one of my pictures, so let's see. So this is uh, me from 10th standard, obviously. Uh, I was too young that time. So look great. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yeah, sir. So it's it takes a while. And then when I click hit on generate URL, then it will generate the URL for the uh, file that I have uploaded. And now I'll mint it. So it will redirect me. Uh, just a minute. So okay, no problem. Yeah. No problem. So you can work on it. Uh, so show the other page, uh, the mint page and the camera page. Yes, sir. So uh, after I mint it, then it will go into this mint page where the photo will get minted out here. And uh, as you can see that the site is all about outfits. So I think so. This uh, uh, picture which you have to upload is about your outfit and how you want to look or whatever you want to buy. So if I see someone having the same uh, fashion sense as me and I like his or her fashion sense too and I want to buy that thing for me so I can do this thing and I can mint it and uh, I can use it for many shopping apps. Now let me show you uh, here in form. If I cl click on snap it then it will directly go to the camera page where you can see myself. Hello. Hi guys. So this is the camera page where uh, the camera settings is there and here if I click a picture for example no that's ugly so 
yes now it's fine so uh, i will be able to mint it in the mint page now as Got it is a preview so uh, this is how it will work but uh, as soon as we have also given one more option for example uh, as you had seen in this camera when i took a picture and when i clicked on mint there was a download thing so uh, the picture automatically gets downloaded to as well as minted uh, when you uh, like literally deploy the app and uh, you make it work and this was just Got a preview it. thing which i had given about the ui ux yes nice nice so uh can you show us the the process of how did you started on the editor the zbyte editor basically yes sir can you see it yeah yeah yes sir so this is my workspace so this is how uh, i, I think i think i think still it's on the page of camera i think you need to probably okay. go back or something okay yeah yeah, yeah now now you can I, actually start yes sir Yes, so this is my workspace out here, and uh, as you can see, I had started with some of the demos and NFTs, and then this is my Money Mentor uh, app where I created this uh, DApp of mine. So as you can see here, there are uh, many uh, layers of how you can build a DApp. So here, firstly, the pages. As you can see, that I have made made four pages. So you can add four pages and like. Uh, you can have add forms and images so here are elements some of the elements which uh, i used i used a container i used a button and you can add elements for example audio recorder you can see uh, zbyte has provided many uh, of the inputs for us divider the document viewer this was the file picker which i used for the uh, you can say the uh, the uh, photo uh take taking like uh you can uh pick the photo out there and uh here's how ratings and text and stuff then smart contracts so uh, in the smart contracts i had uh, actually made this nft where uh, i had put in the code for, uh, i had made methods and uh, i had put in the co codes to and js js objects so this is what i did for javascript just a moment no i think so it's in on another page maybe image page yes helper hmm. so this was the uh, here yes so here uh, as you had seen that uh, image url ha had been created after i created on uh, i clicked on generate url so mm. this was the this is the js code and this actually stringifies for example the uh, url which it has picked it uh, stringifies the uh, whole url into that uh, small text box type thing and mm. you can you can make it like this yeah and uh, i had use f i ipfs ipfs plugin to for uh, for minting uh, for minting the camera thing and here here is my mint page where the actual mm. photo will be there and mm. here too i have used this uri tokens token uri mm. json name description mm. this uh, this js code uh, can also be found in the documentation for zbyte and uh, mm. i really found it very helpful the documentation was quite good and it helped me a lot to make this app and last mm. but not the least is the camera part so yeah i i have used ipfs also out here so this is how i built the whole app got it got it so is there was, yes. was there any difficulty uh, you know man where you you found yourself in a difficult position and then later you found solution to that maybe in our documentation or maybe one of our 
uh, uh, you know, support team would have helped you. So that the ones who are actually watching this video and if they want to create something similar to app, they should not get stuck. Any place, anywhere, where did you like uh, where you got stuck and you found the solution? Okay, sir. Firstly, can I stop sharing the screen? Yes, 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 yes. Thanks. Uh, coming to your question, sir. Uh, sir, uh, I had actually faced a lot of uh, issues out here. Uh, firstly, mm -hmm. while making this app, uh, we had a uh, very different idea because uh, many of our uh, classmates were doing the same thing, which was told and only the capturing thing, but we uh, took it a step further. But the thing, the challenge which we were uh, facing was, was that Zbyte wasn't uh, capturing our image and uh, minting it as a PNG, as uh, it was, uh, it, it was not converting it into uh, some or the other mm -hmm. extension which it needed. And uh, Manas sir, as you know, uh, Man, you yourself, Naman sir, and Manas sir both helped us out in that the process, and uh, it was yeah quite a learning journey. Also, uh, I learned about the IPFS uh, plugin, which was very important to uh, you know like cap capture and mint it at the same time, and. Uh, mm -hmm. Uh, there were some some or the other small errors and issues, but they were thoroughly uh, addressed to us by you and Manas. Sir. Yes, got it, got it. So, uh, did, did the documentation part was uh, uh, you know helpful for you to even think of more tabs in the future? I mean, in terms of uh, uh, whatever training that you have learned. Do you think are you capable of building more tabs? And is there any idea that you are currently working on? Sir, uh, as uh, I had uh, uh, done the workshop, I explored the documentations too, and I found many interesting things like the uh, use cases of uh, the elements and uh, many, many more plugins that I uh, came across. The NFT, as uh, you had said, uh, so yeah. uh, that was amazing and uh, I feel I after the workshop I felt like yes I can to make a dap uh, without without Naman sir and Manas sir and uh, on my own and uh, just by studying the documentation of Z-White and uh, the documentation is quite well and uh, it is uh, very uh, precise and you can say uh, a beginner can also uh, read it and make start start making a dap, and that's what I like the most about the Zbyte uh, document. Got it. Any any feature that you would as a developer would want, uh, you know, for us to sort of release, uh, to have your dap even in a uh, you know better form or any feature that you want to probably request from our side. Uh, not actually thought about it, sir, but uh, uh, there there might be some some of or the other corrections like uh, the deployment things or uh, like it is it is a hectic thing to deploy it again and again. And uh, I would mm. prefer to like firstly preview the whole app just like we saw it right now. Yeah. And uh, if we could just uh, do it without the deployment and then get a nice and uh, like a desired output first and then if we do the deployment thing and uh, make it work then it would really be nice and uh, yes sir it was quite a uh, nice experience yes, nice 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 great all right yes. uh, thank you so much man and your dap looks fantastic for sure from the ui side as well and i'm sure the bug that we have just seen you can fix it it shouldn't be a big problem since you have already created the whole tap and uh yeah looking forward to many more taps coming from your end and really looking forward to it okay so keep building with cbet thank you so much sir and i'll surely fix that bug sir thank you